Hi, good day. So for today's video, we will be talking about how to fix Forza Motorsport optimizing shaders problem. I got three steps for you to follow to check if it can be fixed. And let's start with the first one. First is to create a VRAM for our driver and disable ray tracing. Now, for that to be done, we'll need to search for control panel, which I already have right here. Click open. Then we go to system and security. We'll look for system. Click on that one. Then this shit page should load up. Then scroll a little bit down. Then look for advanced system settings. There you go. Once we click on advanced uh, system settings, click settings here. Should be at the advanced tab, then go to settings. Then from there, we will be needing to uh, advance there. Change. There you go. So from here, um, we will be needing to make sure that automatically manage paging file size for all drivers is a tick. To pick that up. And then from here, we need to uh, make sure that we select the drive where the Forza Motorsport game is installed. Now for mine, it's in backup, so I'll click on that. Once I tick on that, we will be needing to uh, system manage size. There you go. And then we will be needing to click apply changes, so that's okay. Hit change. Now, once we're done, we will be needing to restart the PC and PC or laptop, whatever you're actually using, guys. Then uh, the apply or the, the changes should be applied. Remember to restart because it will not resume. Now, there are actually some cases where problem users uh, reported that the ray tracing picture in the game doesn't work properly in the graphics card. That's why disabling ray tracing resolved the issue. Now. I can actually, I cannot show you apologies because how you can do it on the end game because it will not allow me to record from there. But all you gotta do is go to the game settings and then disable ray tracing from there. Then of course, don't forget to restart your PC or laptop, whatever you're using, then try it again. Now, if the problem still persists, I got the second step for you, which should be updating our graphics card. Now, for us to do that, of course, you'll be needing to um, open up your GE Force experience. Then we need to go to drivers, or drives, I'm sorry. Then we will be needing to check for updates. Now, if the uh, once you have checked on updates, if you have an outdated um, version, it will allow you to update. Since on mine it's already been updated, it will not let me update. So don't forget to always update your version for your GE Force experience. Then, uh, if in case problem still persists, all you gotta do is uninstall, then just reinstall the game. Now, for us to do that, you'll be needing to just basically open up the app itself and then click on this three button. Then uninstall the game then we install it back because there are some cases this once it's installing before or from the time that you're actually installing some problem might happen or an error might come up that's why it did not install properly the way it should be so there you go guys that's the three steps on how to resolve or that's the three uh, things that you can try to fix forza motorsport optimizing shaders problem and I really do hope that I help you guys enjoy the game. And thank you for watching. Bye for now.